Shay, thank you. More children in our area are getting sick with a rare syndrome related to COVID-19. That's according to pediatricians at Children's Hospital of New Orleans, which is both treating and studying the syndrome. WDSU's Jennifer Crockett joins us live there with the symptoms to look out for and which kids are most likely to develop it. Jen? Gina Sala, this syndrome is rare but dangerous. It's called multi-system inflammatory syndrome in children or MISC. The symptoms include rash, fever, upset stomach. According to the Department of Health, 119 children in our state have gotten MISC since the pandemic first hit last spring. Five of those kids have died. The state statistics show black children and boys are most likely to develop the syndrome. This health disparity is being studied now, along with why kids get sick so long after a coronavirus infection that starts the whole syndrome. Dr. Tom Kimball at Children's Hospital says MISC does not show up until four to six weeks after a child is exposed to COVID-19. It looks like what happens is somehow the acute coronavirus infection turns on the immune system of the of the patients and that takes a while to get revved up and so that's why there's probably a delay four to six weeks uh, this hyperimmune response and because of that hyperimmune response, children with MISC do have to be treated in the hospital. The doctors tell me you need to get your kid into the emergency room as soon as you notice those symptoms we just spoke about earlier. Here at Children's Hospital, they said they've treated five kids just this month with MISC. They didn't have any cases in December. Coming up at 6 o'clock, hear what parents have to say about the syndrome. Reporting live, I'm Jennifer Crockett. Back to you. Jennifer, thank you. Today, the Louisiana